Without objection, the gentlewoman is recognized for one minute. Mr. Speaker, I rise today in recognition of National Police Week and to honor the memory of law enforcement officers who have lost their lives in the line of duty. All Americans are grateful for these brave men and women and the ultimate sacrifice they made. During my time as Deputy Mayor of Indianapolis and U.S. Attorney, I witnessed firsthand the burdens and challenges faced by our law enforcement officers and their amazing families. But even more importantly, I witnessed men and women in blue who have overcome these challenges while displaying so much compassion and commitment to duty. Our nation must embrace them and be forever mindful of their integrity and service. Sadly, we've learned it's estimated that every three and a half days in this country, Country, we lose an officer in the line of duty. This week, we will remember 117 officers killed in 2014, including four officers from Indiana, Jeffrey Westerfield of Gary, Perry Wren of Indianapolis, Nicholas Schultz of Merrillville, and Jacob Calvin of Tipton County. We're thankful for their service and send our thoughts and prayers to their loved ones. And without hesitation, we renew our appreciation and steadfast commitment to our heroic women and men in blue. Thank you. I yield back.